Absolutely. Um, you know, that's like you said, we still have some time. We still have a decent amount of games, but every single game is important. Every point's important. Uh, you know, the teams that we're chasing are obviously really good teams, too. They're not giving us any uh, any chance to really catch up. So we got to just focus on taking care of our end of things. And we do see a lot of our division rivals, um, you know, come down the stretch. So uh, those are going to be big games for us. Speaking of that, you guys just wrapped up your first divisional series against Cleveland. What's the, how does that affect like, the urgency of the season playoffs are coming? Yeah, you know, well, we only have a handful of home games as well. So that's something that, um, you know, in looking forward to the schedule, there's, you're, you're in a grind. There's a lot of hockey to be played. But um, like you said, there's, there's some urgency to make sure we're getting the points that, that we need to get. Um, and it'll be nice to play a couple of different teams uh, in this upcoming stretch. What's a guy like Adam Clendenning added to that locker room? He seems like a, one of the vocal leaders. And I don't know if you had an abundance of those coming in. No, I mean, we certainly didn't. Uh, so he's definitely a personality. He's he's definitely the, the loudest guy in the room. We had a guy like Vinny, who was, who was similar in that in that regard at the start of the year, who you know brought a lot of personality to our locker room. And, um, you know, Clendo has come in and filled a little bit of the, that void that that Vinny left when he was called up. So, um, you know, he's been he's been obviously a great addition for us on the ice as well. How much of a lift has it given you guys to see Samuelson come in here and do what he's done? Oh, it's awesome. You know, I've I've been in that position before. Um, you know, being a call up guy, and and it can be difficult, especially. You know, you might only have a couple game window to show what you can do, and you might not play in the best situations and this and that. But he's obviously taken full advantage of it, and. Uh, you know, for me being on that end and knowing how much it means to be able to come into a team and contribute right away so you're not gripping your stick and, you know, wondering after a couple of games go by when it's going to happen. So, uh, you know, it's been great for us and uh, I wouldn't expect anything different. What, what does he do well? I mean, anything jump out at you about his game so far? I think he's just a smart player and he's confident in himself and his skills. Um, you know, he, all he needs is a little bit of room to be able to make that nice shot um, you know for example in the last last game he got it in the slot and just seems like one of those guys that's not going to miss too many of those opportunities so um, he's obviously a talented player and uh, we're lucky to have him here the trade deadlines coming up on monday is that something that weighs on your guys minds at all think about that um you know that's kind of out of our control uh, you know we had a sense with say somebody like polka that you could use a could have used a fresh start, so um, you know you know that in this business those kind of things happen. We've had a you know a good core here for a little while, and you know it's nice to get the, some of that familiarity. So um, we're just going to continue to focus on our own games and the personnel. Um, you know whatever if if Chicago ends up doing something, then um, you know that that's that's fine. We're, we'll still have the same mentality going into our games.